Selling stuff is all about advertising. It's no wonder that billions of dollars circulate in marketing as whole departments hope to create a banger that will leave long-lasting impressions. It's time-consuming, expensive, and requires a lot of expertise. Fortunately, there's already a shortcut for this, which goes by the name of Ad Creative AI. It's a platform built to simplify the entire ad creation process and help small businesses maximize their ad spend on highly converting, fashionable marketing pieces. Before we get into the nitty gritty details of this tool, let's take a quick step back and see what Ad Creative is. At its core, it's an AI powered creation platform that automates the design of ads. It enables users to craft professional quality marketing material without extensive skills, which makes it a perfect fit for beginners and small businesses. What's great about Ad Creative AI is that it supports many platforms like Facebook, Instagram, and LinkedIn, optimizing the ads for each channel equally well. Sounds great, but how do you start using it? To do so, you'll need to register an account. First, navigate to Ad Creative's website and sign up using your email or social media accounts. Then, if you choose to register via email address, a confirmation letter containing an account activation link will drop into your inbox. Click on it to finish the registration. And that's it. Otherwise, if you opt to register with a social media account, you'll be logged straight in. No additional steps are needed. For convenience, I left Ad Creative's link in the description. Alternatively, you can scan the QR code on screen right now and you'll be taken straight to the provider's website. The first time you log into the website, you'll be asked to fill in your brand information, including name, description, and upload a brand logo. What I noticed immediately though, is that the user interface and the color palette is really inviting and light. Anyway, once we're done filling in the details, we're then taken to the main menu. It might look a bit daunting at first, but there's nothing to worry about. Ad Creative AI even asks if you want to tour around their tool. And if you click yes, you'll get a nice and clear explanation of the main functionalities and features. I've tested many AI tools already, and credit where credit's due, Ad Creative AI takes the onboarding of their new clients seriously. Anyway, let's get into the bread and butter of this tutorial, Ad Creative AI features. There are a ton of them, so let's review the main ones first, starting with the Ad Creatives. Here, you can generate image and video ads tailored to your brand. Then there's the ad texts, which is basically a copywriting tool for both headlines and long form text. And moving on to the last one for now, competitor insights. It provides a window to analyze your competitor's strategies, helping you gain insights into how to outperform them. But before you start generating plans on how you're gonna become the leader in your industry, we need to learn how to generate an ad in the first place. To start creating an ad, click on Generate in the top left corner. Here, I can choose parameters such as the size and format of the ad I'm gonna create. I chose the square 1080 by 1080 format, which is perfect for Instagram. Since I already have the headline, I can use it to prompt the AI. If you don't have one, no worries. You can quickly get one by using the text generator. It will even fill in the relevant fields for you automatically. Great. Now, once we filled in the fields, we can choose a background for the ad. We have the option to choose a stock image or upload our own. I chose a stock image since I'm just showcasing the AI tool. We can now click generate and Ad Creative AI will generate multiple ad variations. Yep, it's really that simple. What's important to note is that the results will vary as they will with all AI tools. The clearer and better crafted your prompt is, or in this case, the headlines are, the better the results will be. So keep this in mind and play around with the ad generation tool. To put this into perspective, let's compare a couple of different sets of headlines I've tested. As you can see, the first prompt that we just saw unfold is not that good. Admittedly, if this were the first result you saw after generating your ad, you'd be disappointed and rightfully so. However, the following ads clearly showcase how a well-chosen stock background and prompt can knock it out of the park. As you can see, the difference is stark, especially when you put both ads next to each other. The moral of the story, put some effort into crafting the idea for your ad. And with the AI, you'll see the magic happen. But seriously, in general, though AI will help you implement your ideas, the creative ball is still in your court. Anyway, if you think that the results still could be improved, you're free to edit the ad afterward and fix any typos or mistakes you noticed. But what if you're unsure whether your generated ad is good or not? Well, Ad Creative AI even displays a score, predicting if it's going to perform well. 
the higher the score, the better. So my advice is to take a peek at this metric from time to time as well. But of course, your own judgment is the best. Now that we've seen Ad Creative AI in action, we need to briefly cover its additional features and the functionality it brings to the table too. First, there's the competitor insights, which help you see how many total visits there were, as well as audience insights, social media usage, and more. Another feature worth noting is the creative insights. It's not live yet, but it'll help you gain insights into every creative's performance and what resonates with your audience and what doesn't. And lastly, there's the creative scoring we touched upon earlier. It grades your freshly created ads, so yeah, make sure to check the score and decide what to do next accordingly. All right, we've covered a lot, but there's another important pain point to address, pricing. Is this AI ad creation tool expensive? Well, that depends. Since the provider built its platform tailored for both beginner and professional agencies, the pricing varies. The starter subscription is ideal for small businesses, offering a set number of ad creatives you can generate per month. On the other hand, the professional plan is a good choice for growing businesses that need access to premium features in order to make highly creative marketing. The ultimate and enterprise level subscriptions are for larger companies and agencies. If your business is healthy and making money, this is an option worth considering. Either way, regardless of what kind of subscription you're looking for, I'd suggest getting the free seven day trial first and deciding afterward. Since the free trial is the plan with the least available features, you'll know the baseline and can decide on whether you wanna to commit to more afterward. You'll have to put down your credit card details though, so keep that in mind. So what do I think after this ad creative AI tutorial? Well, it's an interesting tool for sure. I like that the user interface is streamlined and it's very easy to find what you're looking for. However, making your ad creative vision come alive can still be challenging. And since the amount of prompts you can do is limited, there's so much room for error. So while it could easily be included in the best AI ad design platform list, it's still got room to grow. But isn't that true about pretty much all AI tools? In any case, I can easily recommend you test ad creative out as it offers a seven day free trial. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.